Often people ask me, what is true love? What does it mean to actually love a person? What is the difference between love and attachment? And I tell them that love is about wanting to make the beloved happy. Whereas attachment is expecting the other person to make you happy. Love is the concern one feels for the well-being of the beloved. It is the willingness to even let go of that person. If that's what leads to their ultimate happiness, if that's what works best in their ultimate interest, and even if that causes immense pain to us. On the other hand, attachment is about blindly holding on, even after knowing that it could be harmful to the one whom you love. True love is about a sense of service, saying, I am yours. Whereas attachment is about a sense of possession which says, you are mine. Two women were fighting over a child. The first one said, this is my child. Do not touch him. I will not allow you to take him. What are you saying? I am the mother of the boy. Why are you snatching him away from me? Said the second woman. The poor child was too young to speak and had absolutely no idea what was going on. Soon a crowd gathered there and some of the townspeople took this case to a wise man who was known for resolving disputes. The man asked the first lady, so what's the problem? The lady replied, this boy is my child sir. I was doing some daily chores as my son was playing in the courtyard of the house. This woman picked up my child and ran away. Thank God I saw it and chased her to get my child back. The wise man then turned to the second woman wanting to hear her side of the story. The woman said, she's a liar, sir. It was she who picked up my child from the courtyard of my house as I was busy doing my work. Luckily, I could catch her or else today I would have lost my son. All the townspeople who were watching this drama had no clue whose story was real and whom to believe. The wise man got up from his seat and with one of his fingers drew a line on the ground. He then asked both the women to stand on either side of the line and place the child in the middle, right on the line. He asked the first woman to hold the child's left hand and the second one to hold its right. He then told them, now look, each one of you should pull the child to your side. Whoever successfully drags the boy over to your side, the child belongs to her. The first woman pulled the child hard with all her strength. As the child cried in pain, the second woman who couldn't see the plight of the child cried out, please, please let the child go. Look at how he is so pained and crying so bitterly. The second lady, without even trying to pull the child, broke down in tears as she released the right hand of the child, thus allowing the first woman to keep the boy. The first woman being victorious exclaimed, yes, the child is mine and was about to leave with the boy. The wise man said, please wait a minute, ma'am. He then turned to the townspeople and asked them, who do you think loves the child more? The first woman who didn't care a damn about the pain of the child or the second one who was willing to let go of the child to save it from pain and injury. Everyone unanimously agreed that the child belonged to the second woman who hugged the little boy and wept tears when he was given back to her. I remember a beautiful quote from someone that I once read. It said, when you like a flower, you just pluck it. But when you love a flower, you water it daily.